You know I don't like to be all by myself. Hi everyone. My name is Harmony. Leaked. New female robot. Weekly Boston Dynamics News. Boston Dynamics remains to be a leading name in the world of robotics. Let's take a look at the latest happenings in the world of Boston Dynamics. A multi-year agreement signed. Amid the boom we've seen in recent years surrounding the world of autonomous vehicles, Velodyne LiDAR has been one of the companies leading the way in developing the LiDAR technology used in these vehicles. It's not just the AV world in which Velodyne is making their mark and being noticed by industry leaders though, their LiDAR technology is also being used for mobile robots and a new agreement has ensured that will continue. Late last month, Velodyne announced a new multi-year agreement between them and robotics company Boston Dynamics for the former's LiDAR sensors to be used in the latter's mobile robots. The kind of freedom of movement LiDAR allows is going to be important for the tasks that Boston Dynamics robots, including its famous spot, is going to be called upon to complete. These robots can feasibly become a significant presence on construction sites and at workplaces like a manufacturing plant, distribution center, and warehouse. As an example, Spot can be used throughout the life of a construction process to autonomously capture 360-degree images and videos, allowing for digital twin and BIM creation to easily monitor process being made on buildings in construction, and even buildings which are finished. These sensors will allow Spot to move through these sites safely and without human intervention, avoiding obstacles and finding the best routes. Spot carries out site survey in Shetland. Boston Dynamics Spot Robot Dog has been successfully put to work in a remote construction setting to collect data and create site records. In a trial led by Bam Nuttall, Spot was equipped with a Trimble X7 3D laser scanner and both were controlled remotely using a private 5G communications network covering the 55,176 square meter site, marking the robot's first 5G deployment in the UK. Remote operation proved the robot could take on days of manual surveying work and operate in areas and conditions hazardous to people. Spot was deployed as part of a 5G testbed funded by Department for Digital, Culture, Media and Sport. Bam Nuttall led a consortium with Atocor and BRE to create a private 5G standalone network on a remote construction site in Shetland and employ several new technologies and review their benefits for construction. In a statement, Brian Ringley, construction project manager for Boston Dynamics said, This project is exactly the kind of application where a robot inherently makes sense and can immediately add value. It also shows that we can operate Spot effectively from hundreds of miles away and collect very reliable, repeatable data. It keeps staff from needing to travel to remote and hazardous locations and it makes the entire surveying project run more efficiently. Stretch commercially available, but sold out for 2022. A year ago, mobile robotics company Boston Dynamics introduced a new prototype, Stretch, designed for warehouses and distribution centers. The robot is now commercially available, but all units are already sold out through 2022 due to strong pre-order demand from early adopter customers, the company said in a statement. The next units are expected to be delivered in 2023 and 2024. Stretch is an autonomous mobile robot that is able to unload floor-loaded trailers and containers for use in warehouses. Equipped with a custom vacuum gripper, the robot can handle a wide range of package types, sizes and cases up to 50 pounds. Its advanced vision system enables Stretch to detect boxes and the container surroundings. The robot is, for example, able to autonomously recover any packages that may fall during unloading. The robot is capable of working more than a full shift on a single charge or up to 16 hours with a high capacity battery option. Stretch is designed to maneuver in and out of trucks and tight spaces in a warehouse. It can be installed within existing warehouse infrastructures in just a few days. It does not require any pre-programming of SKU numbers or information on box sizes. Stretch makes its decisions in real time without the need for explicit directions or supervision. Another job for Spot at Tamago Aluminium. The Australian primary aluminium producer, Tamago Aluminium, has deployed on work Spot with more advanced technology. The introduction of Spot in Tamago makes it Australia's first aluminium smelter to trial the new AI technology, with impromptu demonstrations to showcase its unbelievable capabilities.
The price of spot comes around with a cost of 200,000 US dollars each and weighs a little over 32 kilograms. This is one of the newest developments in the field of robotics which has unimaginable agility and can navigate all types of landscapes with extraordinary mobility, carrying out day-to-day -day inspections in the most inaccessible places. SPOT, as we know it, is developed by Boston Dynamics and was put through a series of essential tests in the smelter's electrical substation and pot rooms, while employees took a turn at the controls to operate the robot across a vivid obstacle course consisting uneven ground, water puddles, and stairs. SPOT was also navigated through strong magnetic fields to check it remained unaffected by electronic interference. The robotic Enigma passed all the tests taken with valor and pride. As part of the testing protocol, Spot was subjected to a lonesome walk with previously programmed routes or a learned path around the facility to see if it could carry out all the tasks without any assistance. Spot passed this test too. Substation electricians from Tomago were able to send the robot inside the switchyard to perform thermal imaging inspections while they were live streaming images from Spot's built-in stereo cameras to their laptops and tablets. Working alongside Spot proved to be an exciting experience for those involved in the clan, with substation supervisor Shane McDonald referring to the experience as eye-opening. We were amazed at how autonomous it was, Mr. McDonald said. Robot Dog Gets an Autonomous Tail for Swimming Boston Dynamics Spot may be famous for grabbing beer cans and other fun stuff, but the machine dog developed by Ghost Robotics was meant to be a trooper's best friend. It can now tackle challenging terrain, inspect dangerous areas, and even carry a weapon. Starting now, it will also be able to cross small bodies of water, making it the animal-inspired version of a military vehicle. That's possible due to a brand new tail for the Vision 60 dog. It's called Knot, or Nautical Autonomous Unmanned Tail, and it was developed by Onyx Industries for Ghost Robotics. As Popular Science explains, this is basically an underwater propulsion system that helps Vision 60 move with vectored thrust in a body of water. This autonomous tail can operate for approximately 35 minutes using a dedicated power source and then continue to function using the robot dog's internal power source. Don't imagine the Vision 60 dog cutting through the waves like a professional swimmer. Knot can only propel the robot dog at about 3 knots, 3.4 miles per hour or 5.4 kilometers per hour. But that's enough to enable the QUGV to make its way through streams and calm waters. If watching a four-legged robot climb terrains or move around with agility isn't impressive enough, seeing the Ghost Robotics dog swim is pretty mind-blowing. This skill will turn Vision 60 into an even better scout, making sure that an area is safe before the troops arrive. It could also make it a powerful patrol asset for coastal areas. It sported a rifle, which freaked everyone out, it now boasts a tail, and there are still things to come for the Vision 60. The versatility of this robot dog hasn't met its limits so far. That's all for this video, folks. See you another time.